Greetings, humanoids of the internet. My name is Bob, and this is episode two of KSP Career Career Mode with Bob. Is that the right name of the, Is that the name of my series? I don't know. KSP Career Mode. Yes. Um, in 0 0.24 in beautiful 60, 64 bits. Uh, now, is my mic on? Hold on. Yes, my mic is on and Mango is in my lap. Mango Tango. You here to watch me go into space, baby? Yeah. A little bump. Got a bump on your head. Okay. Um, now, here's the deal. I don't want to go straight to the moon. Um, I want to pick up a little science first. Uh, there's a mission I know of that I, that I can do in orbit, but I don't know if I can get any, any science for that. Uh, let me see. Yes, he doesn't really, not really like uh, uh, Gene, the actual mission control guy. Let's see. Rescue Dunsey, Kermit? If I get money for that, I don't get... Uh, I don't get any science for that. Money is good, but uh, I need science. Need more science. Uh, hold on, the cats needs att attention. Okay, this is a little risky. I'm going to do a mission that I'm not going to get anything from except science. Um, uh, and uh, so it's all on my dime. Uh, about a uh, little bit more than a tenth of all the money I, I got. Um, so, yeah, a little bit risky. But I really would like to have some more science than what I have before I actually go to the moon. Uh, and that, um, that mission um, that she was showing me uh, in the, the the one where I rescue the guy from orbit, uh, that would be get me get, get me money, but it wouldn't be getting me any science uh, to speak of. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to fly this guy uh, to the North Pole, uh, land on it, uh, climb out here, uh, hopefully, uh, take a soil sample. I hope climb back in and then make some progress in the direction of uh, the space center. Obviously, I'm not going to be able to get all, the whole way there. Um, and then uh, and then land. But at least if I can get kind of close to the space center, um, just considering how this is a relatively small rocket, um, then that that's going to hopefully increase my my return of the parts here. Uh, so that's my thinking on that. Go ahead and put a decoupler here. So I have uh, these two parachutes to land the whole thing at the North Pole, uh, and then this parachute uh, when I come back. Uh, the first stage with solid rockets. This will be the second stage. Uh, this would be uh, basically a landing and then uh, and then the uh, launch back towards uh, the space center uh, and then finally recovering the capsule or, or I may try to recover the whole thing uh, this whole thing uh, but in any case yes a little bit risky Let me check my staging. That's all right. I said there's no decouplers there. Oops.
Okay. Yeah, a little risky. I've got no struts, I don't believe. You know what? I got struts. Let's use them. How much they cost? 42 bucks. I think I can swing that. I think that's in our budget. Uh, dorky damn thing. Oh, I've got these uh, launch stabilizers too. Well, isn't that swell? 200 bucks. But I'll recover it right on the launch pad, right? So. Do you move that down here? Let's do move that there. Okay, clearly something is not right. That's not right. Okay, saw boosters. Deploy this. Get rid of the stabilizer. Uh, decouple that main rocket decouple lander rocket parachutes and finally the last decoupler and last parachute okay <sighs> well I'm gonna need a, a more powerful rocket anyway um, uh, if I'm gonna rescue do that rescue mission later on which I'll just, just be doing for the money but I need to get I need to give me some science first. So this should, I hope, do the job for me. Uh, to the cost of thirteen thousand Kerbal bucks. Okay. All right, let's do it. Do I, I don't have any SES yet. No, I don't. Who, who's in the uh, cockpit? Jebediah, of course. Jebediah, take a break. We'll, we'll uh, put uh, Bill in there. He's next in the rotation. Got to get the other astronauts some experience too. And launch. <coughs> do I feel good about this mission? No, I do not. Of course, I, I often don't feel good about missions that in fact turn out just fine. This may not be one of those. Okay. Ready for launch. And three, two, one, go. Yeah, it doesn't want to steer with us all rockets. Get pointed north. Let's get pointed north, please. Thank you. Uh, not all the way north, please. Don't need to be pointed that far north. Thank you. far away I'm getting to get from the Kerbal Space Center here. This will find out. I need to get more altitude. Not even in the upper atmosphere yet. Uh, stop it! 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 
God damn it. Wasted fuel. Still wasted fuel. Go on, stop. Stop. Stop, god damn it. Let me see whether I'm getting to the North Pole yet. No fucking way. Okay, well, we're going to have to recover from wherever it is we land. away from the Cape Carmel Space Center yet? Not very much, very much. kind of a failure. Let, unless I get to another biome. Now if I get to another biome that may be just as good as getting to the North Pole. But if I don't get to another biome, I got a problem. Making it over those mountains if we don't don't get some action here. This might be the sort of mission I don't have very often, which is a failed one. The way I can, I can tell, I guess, um, whether what biome I'm in. Am I still in grasslands or somewhere else? Ah, that was a little close. I was gonna lose you there, Bill.
All right. Well, if I wind up spending eleven, thirteen grand um, for just a, a smidgen of science, it's not really very much worthwhile, is it? I mean, at least I'll I'll recover some stuff, but uh, at this distance, that's not going to give me that that much for it. I don't think. Although I'm only sixty-five kilometers from the Kerbal Space Center, so maybe it'll give me full credit. Come on. Okay, good deal. Observe the goo. Okay, I'm in the Kirk in Kerbin's Highlands. Keep data. Okay, even though there's no ladder for you, I don't I haven't unlocked ladders yet. Let's go ahead and have you EVA. Whoopsies. Oopsies. Plant flag. Just for grins. Yes, we were here. <laughs> one, one of... One of NASA's lesser known missions. Okay, we fucked up. I don't know why I'm writing effed up when I actually said it with my words fucked up. This is, okay, we fucked up. Alright, buddy. Take a sort of sample. Deep data. And let's go ahead and recover. Is there anything else I can need to do? EVA report. <laughs> no, not really. Deep data. Okay, 11.4 science earned on this mission. Okay, well that's uh, kind of sucked. Uh, well, shit. I get no science for that. Now it's going to take a lot more science than what I got. Yeah, I need some cheap and easy science here. I am not finding it. Aha! Uh -huh. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I don't really like these research missions. <coughs> okay, well I'll get some money, but not very much. Not getting that money, honey. I can rescue uh, Duncy, but I'm not... I'm not going to be getting uh, much. I'm not going to get any science for that. So it means I have to go to the moon with the tech I have, and that's just not that's just not happening. I need science. Need more science. <sighs> I get six science from that. That's not really worth a damn. Let me figure out what our next step is. Okay, just to get some quick and easy science, uh, we're going to do a little marine biology. We're going to uh, launch this thing into the ocean, uh, do an EVA in the ocean, and do some mystery goo in the ocean. Uh, 
probably won't get that much science, but then again, skin is not an expensive mission. Uh, and I'm getting desperate, so. Oh, Jebediah. Get Bob in there. Maximum SAS on. And three, two, one, go. I like C. Speed. I need to turn my light on. I can't see my keyboard. There we go. Oh, I can't transmit shit. Oh, let's not let's not land on the island there. That would be uncool. Okay. Get ready to deploy the chute. And deploy the chute. I know this is exciting work for you, Bob, but, you know, hey, science has got to be, we got to get our science on, so you're now a marine biologist. Hope you're okay with that, Bob. Okay, come on. Okay, get ready for splashdown. Hope I don't break the goo canister. Because if I break the goo canister, I'm kind of screwed here. Observe Mr. Goo. Keep that data. Hey, Mr. Bob, the CBA. Go. 
How does your jetpack work? Not at all. Doesn't work in the slightest. Okay. Take server sample. Keep data. EVA report. Keep data. Yes, Should I get him back into the spacecraft before I recover data? If that's probably not even possible. Nope. Let's go ahead and recover. Come on, give me science. I need that science something awful. I didn't keep the crew report. It kept kept the EVA report and the surface sample, but it didn't keep the crew report. Damn it. Shit. I may have to go to the moon after all. I do not have enough science for, sh for shit. Fuck. Fuck, 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 fuck. God damn it. Alright. What, what you gonna do? We gotta go to the, guess we gotta go to the moon. Actually, first we'll go ahead and rescue that Durban Kerman guy. Although I should get enough cash to go to get to, um... I won't have ladders. How, how am I gonna get out of a fucking capsule without ladders? I'll be able to land the guy there. I guess I'll be able to transmit his data, but I won't be able to get him out and get him back again. Yeah, no fucking ladders. Well, that'd be nice to have. Ain't got the science for it. Yeah, and still no, still no goddamn ladders. How am I supposed to get the guy out of the space capsule and back again without goddamn ladders? Do I already have ladders and missed out somewhere? No, I don't have ladders. I ain't got no ladders. Shit. Well, fuck. Alright, let me figure something out. Okay, it says we have to achieve orbit around the moon. We have to transmit or recover scientific data around the MUN. We have to land on the MUN. And since we have to transmit or recover scientific data from the surface of the MUN, it doesn't actually say we have to bring him back. Um, so whoever's next in, in the rotation might have to stay there for a while. Um, but there's one thing seriously lacking in our, in our um, overall repertoire of scientific stuff. And that is batteries. Now, it's not actually necessary. If we can bring the guy back, we don't need batteries. No, we can recover data. That's 45 science. We have 30. If we can get 15 science somewhere, we can get batteries and we can transmit uh, data. Uh, and... Uh, we won't actually need to get him back. Getting him back might be tricky. Um, uh, well, clearly we're going to have to go to the MUN because that's the only place we can really get science. If, unless I can get 15 science from somewhere else. Hmm. A MUN rocket's going to be expensive. Uh, granted, I get, mu I get um, an advance of money from uh, from this. Oh, I get 24 grand in uh, in advance. I get uh, 105,000 for completion. Um, well, for for minimal uh, minimal. Um, completion of it, all I have to do is I have to transfer a crew report from lunar orbit, transfer a crew report from the surface. Uh, I get a uh, bunch of money, bunch of money, which I need. 
uh, and uh, also 60 science, which I desperately need. <sighs> All right, well let's 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 go for the moon, I guess. We choose to go to the moon in this decade and leave somebody there, probably. We'll see. Okay, here it is. The God Help Me G <laughs> uh, The God Help Me Jesus Moon Rocket. God Help Me Jesus Moon Rocket. Uh, unfortunately, I see that we are up to 30 minutes, so I'm going to go and call it quits there. Uh, next time, we will attempt to go to the moon. Uh, not sure how I feel about that. Actually, I know I do know how I feel about that. I feel really uncertain and scared. <laughs> uh, but uh, that's all for right now. Uh, and until next time. Wait, 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 wait. Let me see. This is a tough way. Uh, it weighs a bit. Would actually be good to be able to decouple that. Wait a minute. Okay, that's all for right now. Uh, and until next time, hasta la vista. Adios.